Close to 24 hours after the Florida high school shooting, scary moments for students, teachers, and parents at a Baltimore County high school. A student was arrested at Lock Raven High School with a pellet gun in his backpack, causing a lockdown and a massive police response. WJC is live at Lock Raven. George Solis reports it wasn't the only school gun incident in Maryland today. George. That's right. Good evening, Vic. That second scare happening at Clarksburg High School. Police there arresting a student for bringing a loaded handgun as well as a knife on school grounds. Important to know that there were no reported injuries in either case. Now, tonight, concerned parents gathering here in Baltimore County for a town hall addressing the guns on campus issue. WJZ obtaining video of tense moments unfolding inside a Lock Raven High School classroom. A SWAT team moving in to take a 14-year-old student into custody. Police saying the teen, who now faces criminal charges, brought a pellet gun to school, forcing an emergency lockdown. It was, it was definitely scary. Authorities say the whole thing unfolding after a school resource officer was given a tip that the student had the gun in his backpack. Once confronted, police say the teen ran. The 14-year-old later found in a classroom. Following the events in South Florida, parents beyond words to be reunited with their children and to learn there were no injuries. I said thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you, my guys. Across the state, a similar scare was developing in Montgomery County. Police there arresting 18-year-old student Alwyn Chen at Clarksburg High School. They say he brought this loaded handgun on school grounds. The subject of guns on campus dominating a portion of the conversation at a town hall meeting here at Perry Hall High School, which earlier this year had a gun on campus scare of its own. This video showing what was initially believed to be a rifle being carried by an 18-year-old during a fight at the school turned out to be a non-lethal airsoft weapon. The 18-year-old was later arrested. I don't think we're quite prepared as we think we are. At the meeting hosted by a Maryland lawmaker, parents eager to voice their concerns about school safety after these recent scares. Yeah, and it really, it, this one, you know, is, hits close to home. I mean, after what happened in Florida to then have you know, a gun being brought to uh, to one of our local schools is. There's no words that can express the, the feelings that you feel for somebody else when they lose a child like that. You know, it, it's heartbreaking. The hope of everyone in this room and everywhere for that matter is that they never have to. Now, part of that meeting hosted by the delegate included a proposal that would call for revoking a student's driver's license for up to three years if caught with a weapon on school grounds. Also important to note that the motive in both of these cases remains under investigation. Live outside Lock Raven High School tonight, George Solis reporting for WJZ. George, thank you. And tonight's town hall also dealt with other issues, including overcrowding and bullying.